so ESP2 wire controller uh, looks, acts very similar to our ESP ME3 platform. Uh, it's built with the same chassis, the same face panel. The real big difference here is this is a two wire controller. So you have a dial position for two wire settings. In the back of the controller, there's a two wire board, uh, two two wire path connections. Uh, all weather sensors and flow sensors wired directly back to the controller. So with this platform, it fundamentally works slightly differently than other two wire systems on the market, uh, where the two wire path on this system is only energized when something is active. So because of that, you can use standard irrigation wire. You don't need maxi cable. Uh, you don't have special grounding requirements and there are no special wire connectors required. So up to 50 stations. The other key benefit of this controller is rather than standing here and manually entering all the decoder addresses into the controller, uh, once they're connected to the two wire path, I can tell the controller to scan the two wire path. It will learn all the decoder addresses connected and then automatically assign them to stations for you. So that's a massive time saver on two wire installations. Because of the smaller platform, and new decoders, uh, the break even to use two wire versus traditionally wired systems is really around the 15 station range. Um, so other two wire systems, closer to 30, 35 stations where it makes sense. This can be used on large residential, light commercial. Um, there's a huge market for this rather than using traditionally wired systems um, with tons of wire in the ground. So inherent benefits of two wire that come along for those smaller systems.